and Jean says Gagnon here so we're going to talk about stories oh my god there's LinkedIn stories are out they just started I actually didn't even know about it until I saw Gary V talk about it and uh, and he uh, commented about them and then all of a sudden I saw whoops there they are in my phone right so today it kind of reminded me of the process I go through with stories I mean I post a seven well now seven I guess it was six different places my story and how I do it which which platform you should record on which one you need to upload from which ones have what features are on each of them we're going to talk about the different story platforms and how you can leverage them to grow your business to sell courses to grow your fans and how to use it on social media what is the best use of stories and we're going to talk about how I use it I mean obviously but uh, let's get to that in just a second but first this so the real question is this what are the strategies techniques and tools that you need to learn to generate residual income from the e-learning boom that's happening right now my name is Jean-Serge Gagnon and welcome to Course Income Secrets so isn't that cool though LinkedIn stories that just came out we're going to show you how to use LinkedIn stories the basics of it but we're also going to talk about the story platforms on all the different platforms the only one I don't have access to yet is YouTube because it requires I think it's like 10,000 subscribers to have um a, a uh, uh to be able to post stories on 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 YouTube so I'm not really focusing on YouTube that much but I do post there every day and we're going to talk about the story so first let me show you the LinkedIn stories how they work let's go to my desk there's my phone right there I actually have it in my hand right here and that's just the screen right there so if you go to LinkedIn right uh let's just go back to LinkedIn if you go to LinkedIn now they have this this these stories let's see if that mouse is that on the right well I guess you can't see my mouse on top of my uh, screen there but you can see at the top of the screen there um if I can I use my hand oh, right there it's kind of confusing see right there obviously you can see it's at the top the, th the circles that are there those are stories right you can scroll right and left to go see everybody who's posting stories oh my god there's a lot of people posting but I do have 15,000 I am following 15,000 or I got 15,000 connections so obviously I'm gonna have a lot of uh, stories there but how do you how do you do a story it's really simple right you just press a little your story uh, itself and then you click on the new story right there and it loads up your um your camera so you can actually record a story right now and I'm actually going to do that right now I just posted something saying LinkedIn stories so I'm going to do that right now here again because I'm recording this live and I'm just going to say that that I'm recording the episode live and I'll show you how uh, what once you record it so uh, the, well actually before we do that let me just kind of talk to you about uh how you can upload so you can select this so you can select the on the bottom you see uh there's um there's a it's too bad I can't show you with the mouse but yeah you can't see but on the bottom there there's on the bottom uh left there's a a picture and on the bottom right there's the camera so the camera one if you tap it it flips the camera around right it goes to the other side of your um of your uh phone the camera on your phone and then the other one is to upload so you can actually upload videos right pictures and things like that, that you've done you can choose to upload and that's what we're going to talk about in a second but first let's just okay so I'm going to just record a uh, a story right now I'm actually going to record a story right now on my phone and I'm going to say it's about episode CIS 231 and that I'm doing it live and if you want to come see you know more of it you can go to the blog and all that there. so I'm going to actually do that right now in my story on LinkedIn hey how's it going LinkedIn I just love it that there's now a story on LinkedIn I'm not sure you know how it's going to get used by people and everything for me I've been using stories on all the other platforms forever probably four years on Snapchat three years on the others whenever they came out and I'm going to start using LinkedIn stories now but right now oh that's the first the first time I actually so I'm going to just share it I click the share I'm going to do new again oops let's delete that one because it's not the right uh, let's delete that 
new story flip it around so I guess it does the uh <coughs> it always starts with the the rear camera so yeah so I'm doing a, this this live right now I'm actually recording this story right now while I'm doing one of my episodes which I do daily episodes on course income secrets which basically is how to leverage the internet to generate income from the e-learning boom that's happening right now so you're going to go check it out that's cis231.jsgagnon.com cis231 and okay so once you've recorded it I don't know if you have sound let's turn the sound yeah no I guess it's not it's not showing the sound through the the recording of the uh, OBS but okay so now I have the video recorded here right it's on it's on my phone right now and it's playing it's just playing and playing and you can do a few things you can see at the top of the screen you can turn the sound off if you want you click that little uh, speaker thing and the sound is turned off so you can actually post a um a story with no sound and then over and then you can put text on here you can say learn more at cis231.jsgagnon.com right so I'm get, I can put that as text on there <clears throat> now there's different things you can you know center it right and left there's different text you can use or I'm not even sure what that does I guess I I, I guess it's new there it's not working too good oh I guess it's either it's it's either text or all oh, right so it's either text or black box kind of thing right uh, if I center it like this I want it like that and then of course there's colors right you can choose the colors of the background I guess they just have a few colors and if I choose just text yeah text is just the color of the text again right so uh let's just make the box make it uh, green in the background like this make it blue blue let's make it blue purple I don't know right let's make it blue so after that you just tap anywhere on the screen then you can move it around you can twist it around right by using your fingers as you can see on my I'm just using my fingers on the on the phone like this to kind of move it around right resize it make it smaller make it bigger whatever right so I'm going to put it down here like that and I'm just going to share it to my story and there you go it's uploaded now the other thing oh the other thing as you can see on this one you can see I put a sticker right uh, that's a sticker you can you can mention somebody actually I should have probably done that let's do it again yeah so I'm just actually showing people how to use the LinkedIn story app right now and I'm actually gonna in this particular recording here I'm actually gonna add a mention and I'm gonna add a um a, a sticker to show you how that works so there's the there's the thing and as you can see one of the things too that I just noticed just now is that it flips the recording around when I'm recording uh that the books in the background are reverse right mirror effect and then when I when the recording's done it flips it around so you can actually read the text that's in the back so it, even if it looks reverse it'll be unreversed afterwards <clears throat> so it's a reverse anyways whatever right okay so up the top I had the text here right so I'm gonna do the learn more again learn more so watch watch full video at cis231.jsgagnon.com later today later today okay so I'm going to center that and I'm just going to move this down here okay so the mention the way the mention works is up top so you got as you can see there's three icons there's the the speaker there's the sticker and there's the text one so the one in the middle is the sticker one so you click on that and it gives you all these different uh, stickers right so the stickers <laughs> you can either have I guess the question of the day is something that they're putting in there that you can't change it there's only I can't I tried to, to put a different question but you can't it's on a single question and then there's the mention so at the mention I'm going to put uh, I'm going to put a, a few of my friends here Mark Lalonde Mark Lalonde I'm going to mark I'm going to mention Mark Lalonde I'm going to mention uh who else I'm going to mention Chris Collier Collier and just a few of my friends that are in my octo content 
I'm going to mention uh, no that's text I'm going to mention uh, Anthony Anthony Hendrickson there we go I'm going to mention uh, who else I can mention uh, Akabi Alice okay Alice K there we go I can mention Alice we're going to mention uh, Carol there's a lot of these people that <coughs> Carol uh what's her last name I forget her, her last name hmm I don't remember um Brandon okay well I'm, I'm just gonna put these ones <clears throat> and I'm gonna add some text I mentioned you to test to show how to do this stories okay so I just put that so that whoever you know I'm gonna put that up here I'm gonna put that down here there you go so I just put that there so that anybody who sees why they're mentioned they're gonna be like why and so and uh, I'm just gonna share the story there's uh, oh Theodore is it so mention Braddy Theodore ah there we go yes another one here and um, I'm trying to remember there's a there's a lot of other people in a in the group I'm part of I'm trying to remember other names let me see if I can't <clears throat> mm. So I'm just checking in my uh, Facebook to, to try to remember the names of the people here um this and it's Carol Brown Earl okay so Carol Carol Brown Carol Brown Earl. I can't find her she's a she's <coughs> b-r-o-w-n oh there she is okay there's carol brown there's also eugene let's put eugene eugene McGrath. anyway so I don't know how many you can tag and how many you can but I'm gonna just do that like this okay so I share the stories so that's that's LinkedIn so I got LinkedIn stories that's how you that's how you use LinkedIn stories now we're going to talk about the rest of the story platforms and my process as you can uh well actually you can't see I thought that was on the screen but no so we're going to talk about my story process how I do it let's go and share my desktop <clears throat> and basically um that's my process right over here that's my process right here so what I do and you know I record on snapchat so let's do that let's go to let's actually do it right now oh it says right here that my story on LinkedIn did not post I'm not sure if it failed what happened upload failed try again <clears throat> so let's see if that works preparing to upload it says okay let's just let it be okay so how do I how do I do my daily story and what do I use stories for so I record a daily story to tell people about my episode and I also kind of include a little bit about what's going on right what my life is what what I'm working on and things like that so sometimes I'll talk about the the trail I've been building in the back of the house or I'm talking about the potatoes I'm growing or the little trees I'm growing or the plants I'm, I'm a lot into plants or nature and things like that 
um also talk about the door I replaced you know the the renovation I did I do all these things as part of you know getting people getting people to know know right the know like trust factor right that's part of it so I use a story to 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 do that to get people to know like and know know me so that eventually they like me and eventually they trust me and they eventually buy from me right that's the point of stories that's why you want to do them too but should you be creating a story on Instagram or should you be creating a story on Facebook and sh sh why do I do it this in this sequence right there's a couple of reasons so first of all let's actually do the story right now that I'm going to post on all of those and I'm actually going to go through the process with you to kind of show you how that works so first of all in Snapchat you can do different things in Snapchat that you can't do in other platforms right so one of the things you can do in Snapchat is these face filters and you can do those some of these in other in other platforms as well but not necessarily the same ones not necessarily the same filters right so let's use this filter here to do my recording and then I'm, a, I'm gonna do the upload on the other one so let's just do that right now all right hey how's it going okay so today I'm actually recording about stories about LinkedIn stories as well and I'm doing this right now on my computer I'm recording it right now and I'm actually going to post this in my stories I'm actually showing you how I do all the stories so as you can see right here I've got this <clears throat> process that I've got record on Snapchat share on Instagram automate share to Facebook page story share on Facebook profile automated share on messenger stories share on TikTok and share on LinkedIn stories so I do all that every single day I share across and why do I start with Snapchat there's a reason for that so if you want to go check that out go to cis231 cis231.jsgangan.com and go check out the blog and the longer video where actually I'm actually recording this right now you can actually go check out the whole process the LinkedIn stories how all that works go to cis231.jsgangan.com that's j-s-g-a-g-n-o-n dot com so go check that out LinkedIn stories okay so now I've got the video recorded right I'm just going to turn the sound down so we don't it doesn't know we don't hear it <clears throat> but I've got the video recorded now on my phone so Snapchat lets you record up to 60 seconds up to 60 seconds so Snapchat so up to 60 seconds on Snapchat right so the difference with Instagram is you can do also up to 60 seconds on Instagram you can do I believe up to 60 seconds on Facebook as well and I I'm not sure about LinkedIn yet I haven't really used it that much yet but it looks like it, it lets you record more than a 15 second video and keeps going I didn't try it yet but maybe I should but the thing is that the difference and this is this is split into uh 10 second videos right in snapchat so you can see down the bottom here on the bottom of the screen if, if you look at the well I guess you can't anyways on the bottom of the screen right there in the recording that you're watching on my screen you can see down the bottom there there's like these this little area so that kind of shows you the length of the 60 second video okay so then what I anyways we'll talk about a little bit more in a second why I do this sequence but first let's just finish this so what I do here is I actually add some text which is the actual episode that I'm doing so you just press the little t I say <laughs> the actual text let's just actually because this is the text I'm going to use this exact text here I normally cut and paste it from the upload on on Facebook first but in this case I have to type it in LinkedIn stories stories uh is here okay is here I mean I have to use the exact same text because otherwise I would normally okay and then I say how to record how to record uh, a story and share it to a story and share it to how to record a story and share it to uh, seven story platforms so seven story platforms uh, and then question mark right okay so I'm going to just copy all this select all I'm going to copy it and now I've got it in my buffer okay so now I put that up there and then in the in the uh in here I normally put the URL for the course right so cis231 now the problem is that that's not maybe I should uh, make that 
um actually let's do that let's make that an actual post that I'm gonna I'm gonna make it public but it's not gonna be really done yet so let's just go in here and go and create a new post <coughs> add a new post and it's got to be the same text as what's in here so let's just uh, take that text out of there and cancel that that's not what I want this one here oh what happened there I messed something up I think on my on my so this is course income I'm gonna have to oh maybe not okay course income secrets number 231 like this this is I have to put that because otherwise it won't be the right uh, the right um, title tbd I'm just going to do that because I need the link to be the right link so I'm going to make this a <coughs> course income secrets it's going to be uh, anyways I'll, I'll update that I'm going to publish that because I need the link so I'm going to take this link here copy this link and I'm going to go into my zone edit dns anyways this is the kind of stuff I do but I it's what I wasn't planning on making this part of this um, episode but let's just uh let's just go and go with it you'll see what uh, why that's important in a second if I did cis 231 on my phone right now it wouldn't take me to the right page it would take me to my blog home and, and in snapchat when you share the link it actually uh, does a it does a fetch the the actual link of the real link right so cis 231 all right so next <coughs> Let's turn that off over here and we're almost done we're almost ready to keep going with the story thing just a second bear with me for a second here and uh, we're ready 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 almost ready done there we go all right so now I have let's go back to my notes in my all right so now I've got my phone and I'm going to put that CIS 231 I'm going to click on the search icon at the bottom it's going to go to my actual blog post 231 which is the one that just says right here TBD right I'm going to attach it to my snap and then I paste it move it down there I add some more text uh, actually that's not text let's do that text I add some more text which just says swipe up to watch video and read blog I put that down here I actually add my snap code to the video because <clears throat> because I share it to the Facebook uh, to the snapchat story as well now this is only for snapchat then I uh, put a line like this to kind of make it obvious that they have to swipe up and then I just click on the save button I say my story and our story so my story is my story the story that I'm posting to and our story puts it on the map so that other people can find me just by looking at people in PEI right where I'm physically at so I'll just share it and that's going to start to upload it to uh to snapchat and there you go it's uploading right now so let's just swipe up okay so now what I do is I <laughs> share it to Instagram stories so I go into Instagram so sorry about the screen I think it does that whenever um whenever my uh computer is too busy uh the internet so I'm just gonna click so in the Instagram you just click on the top on the little uh, camera icon on the very top right, right next to Instagram <clears throat> and in here I can record a, an Instagram story if I wanted to right and that's they do recommend to do stories for everyone but for me I'm just up I'm recording it once and I'm uploading to all those platforms right so let's upload it here I just tap the upload I select the long oh no did I forget to say oh my god I forgot to save it I normally have to save the video <laughs> I forgot to save it so now what happens I've done that a few times before so now what happens is I have to go into snapchat and save it and it's going to save it with ex all the text and everything so I won't be able to do the actual process I normally do but what I got to do is I got to go here and I have to go to this video here and I have to say 
save <coughs> so now it's going to save it as a snap I forget whether it saves I forget how you how you make sure that it saved your whole story or if it's just the 10 second video let's go see let's go see into uh, Instagram again oh uh, man I'm um, yeah there you go so see the one minute the one minute video is there I can actually share it now the problem with this is that now I have the uh snapchat logo on there and I have the the swipe up thing which isn't going to work in Instagram um I'm very disappointed maybe I should uh, redo this let's redo this I'm just going to redo it again for Instagram and I'm just going to show you how it works and I'm going to go back and snapshot record it there but I'm going to save it there with this hey how's it going actually let's do the same uh, filter just because I want to make sure that it's let's do the same filter we got this pixelated filter here okay so let's just do this hey how's it going so today I'm actually talking about Instagram stories and Facebook stories and LinkedIn did you know LinkedIn has stories that are out now LinkedIn has stories that are out now and I'm showing you I'm actually recording right now this right now live I'm actually showing my screen sharing how to record videos how to record stories how to share stories on all the different platforms you know like this see right over here I've got uh, talking about recording on snapchat sharing on instagram automated share to facebook share on facebook profile sh automated share to messenger upload to tiktok share on linkedin store so how do you do all that go check it out that's cis 231.jsgangano.com cis 231.jsgagnon.com go check it out on how to the linkedin stories how to use them and how to share stories across all the story platforms there's seven there's an eighth one that I don't have access yet but you can do the same thing on all those platforms and okay so now I have the video again and I'm actually going to save it at the bottom you can see there's a little down arrow that's I that's what I always do every day I don't know I guess I forgot because I'm doing this but you just click on the little button down there and it says saving it'll actually save it on my phone now and there's no text no nothing on it no uh, logo no link no anything right so it's just the basic video with nothing on it and that's what I need to to share on the other ones because I want to add things on the other ones right so okay so now it's there I'm just going to exit because I already saved it in a different one but similar <coughs> now I go to Instagram I click the photo the camera icon on the top and then I click the upload which be which basically the box at the bottom at the bottom left which is the 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 uh, down here right right whoops down that's kind of hard to do eh? down there that but that button down there <laughs> so you click on that and then it shows you all your available uploads so you can upload up to one minute anything longer than that it won't let you like say if I was to go back here and I was look at one of the videos I have from yesterday which is my four minute video it'll just take the first the first minute anyways right okay so I'm just going to upload this one here which is the video we just did right now in snapchat so as you can see down there there's four pieces to it it's a one minute video it's going to be split up into four 15 minute videos now the reason I do it on Instagram first is because if I try to share this on on Facebook it will it will split it weirdly I I don't know if they fixed it I just I've just been using it like this but I remember in the beginning when I was I would do that on Facebook it would make the first 15 second video fine but then the next three videos would be like sideways or reverse or something they would be messed up so that when I do it on Instagram this way that's not a problem so here's what I do I go in here I add the text uh first the first two videos I kind of say something about what we're doing and I'm just gonna say uh doing doing live recording recording live recording why does it say be recording recording just recording 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 live recording and in episode in episode right now so I'm just going to say that I put text here I I flip the color I make it a little bit background like this and you'll and I, the reason why I do this with a specific background is because sometimes when I upload my story in Instagram 
it doesn't keep the same order of videos whenever they're available for sharing because sometimes it'll actually finish uploading video number three before it finishes uploading video two and vice versa so when you look in your camera roll they'll be in the wrong order so using this text kind of helps me to make sure I remember the order so the first one is a certain color the next one I just click on the next one and I'm going to say um uh, pretty cool to see LinkedIn LinkedIn stories now stories now okay so I'm just gonna again I'm gonna make a different color here and now I know that the first one was orange the second one is red and then the the last two I post the subject of my um of my uh, a post right so LinkedIn stories this is it here I'm actually going to pin it and that's the that's the one here and I make that green with a background like this move it to the top the next one I do the same thing except that I make it green with green with this way so that way when I look when I look through you'll see when I look through the stories to add in Facebook I know that this one is before this one because of the colors I actually do that in for a specific reason right okay so next I add the link I say learn more learn more at cis because I can't put links in my stories on Facebook or 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 um or Instagram or now in LinkedIn either I have to have the text on there so that people can actually go there if they if they're really interested right so that's and I just copy this select all and copy <clears throat> and then I make this blue with a white and I put it at the bottom I do the same thing with the next one except in this one I make it blue with a full blue background it's just you know I do this the same all the time so that it's not uh, so it's not hard to do then I click on next and I share to my store and by the way I've got it automated so it shares to my Facebook story as well and with Instagram with Instagram it'll share to a Facebook page now until it'll actually share to your Facebook profile as well if you don't have a a business profile and link on Instagram but I mean I've had a business profiles forever and I think there's benefits to that and so that's what I got so but it shares to my Facebook page that's why I say over here <coughs> that when I share on Instagram it automates the sharing to the Facebook story I'm going to say done and now the story is uploading if I click on here and I mouse I scroll up like this you can see that now I have these four new videos that are currently uploading it says posting right so this one's posting <clears throat> it's currently uploading them I can't and I can't put them on Facebook yet so the way it works is that uh this here will split split into four 15 second videos so that's what that's what LinkedIn Instagram does it'll split it into four 15 second videos right so split into six 10 second videos for Snapchat so you could save each of the individual videos from Snapchat by uh, downloading them afterwards but you can't save them before you can only save the full thing whenever you're done recording your one minute do you click that down down arrow thing that records the that saves the whole thing right okay so now it's up it's up these two are, are done the third one here is still posting after it's finished posting the four of them um then I upload to Facebook then I share the Facebook profile store so I go to Facebook we're going to do that right now because it's not not done but it's almost done so you go to your Facebook profile help researchers anyways whatever and then I and then right here you see how it says create a story on your on your um uh with your profile face right there you can click on plus right there and then it gives you the option to upload the different videos so you can see right here that there's my one minute videos down there the one with the snapchat logo which I don't want to use there's the fifth the one minute video that's there that's right there in the in the list and then there's there's one two there's well there's three videos and they all each of them have they're there twice and the reason why they're there twice is because they're there once for the Instagram upload and then they're there again for the Facebook page story upload so they're both the same it doesn't really matter which one you use 
I always use well that and then anyway so that's what I do so I go here now there's only three because the third one's not finished we can and if I close it and go back there you go okay so they're all done so they're all done now you can see there's one two three four there's four videos times two so there's four 15 second videos now I know that they're in the right order but if I was if they weren't like I said in the right order you could see by the text I have on here I know that this was the first one I did I just tap it and I just say share the story it's as simple as that then I go plus again I find the next one that I did number one I'm doing number two that's number two as you can see it's the second one there's no link anywhere anywhere then I do the third one and as you can see this is the the white background one that's the third one and then I do the fourth one and there's the final one with the dark background and that's kind of how I tell whether they're the right order so that's that's how I share it now when I share it to the Facebook profile story it also automates it to the messenger story so if I go to messenger right and I go to messenger where's this I I don't even know how to get to the where is it over here people and there's the stories right there's the stories of people and you can see my stories right here and it's got these videos that are now being uploaded right so they're not they're not they don't show up instantly but they're in that messenger story as well all right it's automatic now the next thing is I upload to TikTok so I go into TikTok and I click on the plus down the bottom here I select upload on the right hand side and I choose my one minute video that's right here and I click on next and I click on next again normally I do a video I do I add sounds you know and and then I do other things I add text on it so right now we're just going to add text we're going to say uh, LinkedIn stories and I'm just going to put it like this I'm going to put it down at the top here and I'm going to make it uh, near the end here like this I'm going to add the uh, learn more in blue and put it up here too I'm going to make it last only the end after the green is gone there we go and I'm just going to say next for now <clears throat> and then I'm going to post the subject again here and I'm going to put the link again here whoops the link and then I'm going to make a hashtag ask Sean Serge entrepreneur probably not enough to put all the ad that's too much so that's fine and then I'm going to select the cover I'm going to put the I'm gonna put this I'm going to put this one here like this well it doesn't really matter because I'm going to put text on top let's put this here I'm going to paste the this here over here I'm going to say save and then I'm going to post it so now I'm posting it to LinkedIn right that's kind of how it works on LinkedIn uh, not LinkedIn sorry on on TikTok so now it's uploaded to TikTok and then I share it I'm going to share it to LinkedIn so you go into LinkedIn and you just click on the plus here and then you say new story and you just click on the upload button down the bottom here and you just go and find the videos so now there's so there's there's I just got to figure out which one so th th it's the same thing as on Facebook right there's there's doubles so this would be the first one right here because you can see the size right it's it doesn't say the time on on, on LinkedIn so you can't really tell but you can tell from the size see the <laughs> see the 23 meg one is the full minute one I don't know if I can upload the full minute one I haven't tried that yet I'm just going to use the same ones as in my um in my uh Facebook uh, link uh, Facebook and Instagram so I'm going to share the story do another one here go back to number two this is number one right here number two is right here then I'm going to do another one upload again number three is this one and then do another one share and number four and there you go so now I have shared to all these platforms <clears throat> I've shared to I recorded on snapchat I shared on instagram stories I, sh I that automatically goes to facebook page stories I share on facebook profile story that automatically goes to messenger stories I share on, an upload I upload on tiktok 
and then I share on LinkedIn so seven story platforms I mean TikTok isn't really a story platform it's very simple it's kind of but that's how I share on all the stories so I hope you enjoyed this and uh, that you got some value from it and we'll see you in the next episode this has been course income secrets the entrepreneur's blueprint to generating income from the e-learning boom. Some of your friends need to hear this message, so don't forget to share. For more content like this, go to CourseIncomeSecrets.com and make sure to subscribe and follow us here. My name is Jean-Serge Gagnon. Until next time.